Greece and island hopping go hand in hand. With so many beautiful islands to choose from, you're bound to have a great time. As my final days in Athens approached, I decided to island hop. But sometimes, things don't always go as planned. Okay, there's the trip. I, I have to, I have, I booked a like yacht tour around the islands tomorrow. It's kind of all day. And um, I have to figure out like where I'm parking this thing. I honestly have no idea. So there's a stop right here and there's a map and this one's going to Goya, I guess. I'm not even sure. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna check out the map. I'll, I'll it is quiet out. So I uh, rented a space on a yacht and I have to go find the pier, which is on the other side of town. Uh, it's really quiet right now. It's um, seven in the morning right now. I'm waiting for the tram. I'm not a morning person, I'm tired. I had coffee. I feel like I rushed. You know how it goes. Upon arriving at the dock, the yacht was nowhere to be found. I was so confused. And not only turns out I was at the wrong place, but I also booked the yacht tour on a different day. I went back to my hostel and napped my frustration away. Okay, I bought my tram ticket. And I think I'm ready to go for tomorrow morning. I just have to validate it once I start using it. Oh shit. Maybe I should have bought it tomorrow. I don't even know. They just said validate it, um, and then you could use it. I don't know. We'll see. It is like downpouring today. Have I mentioned how much I hate rain? Like I hate it with a fiery passion. Oh, it's just so annoying. Like, the umbrellas and stuff, and wet feet, and ugh. You know what? I used to be a swimmer and I was always wet all the time. This is what it's like. It's like never being out of the rain. It's it's ridiculous. And to, to top it off, you know, you would think that places where they get a lot of rain would be, you know, they would have the infrastructure, and no, they don't. There's like four inches of water on the street. You want to cross the street, you better get ready. Even though it was sunny throughout my entire Athens getaway, the one day I decided to get on a boat is the one day it decides to downpour. But I was freaking determined to have a good time. So I'm on the island of Agena right now. Uh, it's been kind of rainy all day. So unfortunately, no beaches today, but um, that's cool. It's a cool island. It's actually not a touristy island. Or what they told me was the tourists that come here are all Greek tourists. So they may be the only non-Greek person here. We'll see. Let's go explore. Hollywood really has ruined us, huh? I feel like I'm walking in a Greek set. I mean, it's super cute, but I still feel like it's fake. Like, is this Hollywood or am I in Greece? 
<laughs> I don't know where I'm going. I'm just walking. Behind me is the sail, and there's an island, a Greek island, right here. Since it was raining, the skipper decided we should probably stick to one island for safety. As we departed and made our way back to Athens, the sun decides to come up. Today's my last day in Athens. Tomorrow morning, I get back on a plane and head back to my hometown of Los Angeles. It's been one long but glorious trip. Click on the Isa Mujeres video to start at the beginning of this wild and crazy adventure. <laughs> 